All right, after that, minute number three, we have slow across the body mountain climbers. So that high plank position, instead of coming straight up with your mountain climber, you're going across your body. We got lower creeps coming in here. Okay, yep, so going across your body, nice and slow and controlled. Then you are going to go up on your feet and we have a minute of high knees and a minute of skater jumps. So high knees, getting them nice and high, skater jumps. Side to side, keeping those legs nice and loaded. All right. All right. Okay, sorry. Time to get Scooby Doo going. Okay. Everyone ready? So, first minute is prisoner squats. I'll let you know when to change and what to change to. Let me get my timer ready. All right, y'all. Ready? Rolling in three, two, one, go. Looking good, keep that chest up. Uh -oh. Hope you guys can't hear the Scooby Doo intro. Got 30 more seconds to work. Keep it up, keep it up. Try and pick up the pace for these last 20 seconds. Get those legs nice and warm. All right, three, two, one. We're on the floor, hollow snaps. What's up, Laura? <laughs> so laying down, just snapping up. You don't have to come up all the way. Just get those shoulders and those legs off the ground. That's as high as you have to go. Firing up the core, remember to breathe. Keep it up, keep it up, got 25 seconds left. <clears throat> try and get a nice pause at the top try and hold it for a second or two five more seconds and then we're going into that slow cross the body mountain climber in three two one roll it over nice and slow and controlled opposite knee to opposite elbow You're good guys, try and keep that butt down. Keep those shoulders in line with your wrists. 30 more seconds. Ten more seconds, and then we're switching to high knees. Three, two, one. All right, on your feet. Try and get your knees at least to hip height. So get going and pump those arms, nice and warm. Looking good, guys. Looking good. Have 30 more seconds. All right, we got 15 seconds left. Trying to really crank it out, pick up the pace. All right, in three, two, one, skater jumps. 
Remember to keep your legs loaded. Exploding from side to side. Looking good. Try to stay nice and low. Looking good. Looking good. Try to be explosive out of that jump. Twenty more seconds. Three, two, one, and done. All right. All right, grab a quick drink if you need it. Next up, you're going to need a dumbbell, just one. And if you're using a mat, you can keep your mat. We have some more core work coming your way. All right, so we have five rounds. The intervals are going to get longer and your rest will get shorter as we go. It's three exercises. You're working for a certain amount of time, resting for a certain amount of time. So round one is going to be 30 on, 30 off. And then we'll go 40 on, 20 off for the next three rounds. And then the round five will be 50 on and 10 off. All right. So first one is alternating curtsy lunges. I believe that is with the weight. Yes. In the goblet hold. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just stepping back behind that front leg, alternating back and forth for 30 seconds, trying your best to keep your chest up that whole time. All right. After that, we have alternating dumbbell snatch. Make sure you are touching the ground with that dumbbell every single time and not bending over. We are squatting down to the ground. All right. Really exploding up every single time. All right. If you have to put the dumbbell on the ground to switch, that's totally fine. I know some people for some people that's easier. But totally up to you. After that, we are on the ground for V ups or hollow snaps like we were doing before. So if you can't quite do a V up, you can just do the hollow snaps where your shoulders and legs are coming off the ground. But otherwise, V ups will be coming up all the way, trying to touch your toes at the top. All right. Good. Anyone need anything modified or anything like that? We're all good. Uh, Jess. Oh, for the, uh, okay. Um, we will do, just do an RDL. Yeah. That's about all we can do. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, girl. You're going to have really awesome hamstrings. <laughs> All right, guys, so first round, 30 on, 30 off. Let me get my timer ready. It is three movements. Okay. Setting the timer. It's always going to get me. Okay, 30 on, 30 off, three movements. All right, let's get rolling in five seconds. Go. Oops. All right, three, two, one, go. let's go. Looking good, guys. Keep that pace. Got 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. rest. This is very loud. Oops. All right, 30 seconds of rest. Up next, you have alternating dumbbell snatches. So try and keep your pace the whole time. Don't slow down. All right, get ready. Rolling in three, two, one, go. 
There you go. Finish with the arm right by your ear. Splitting straight up. You guys are looking good, looking explosive. Almost there, almost there. Don't slow down. And rest. All right, next up we got those V-ups or hollow snaps. All right, get ready for some core work in three, two, one, go. Go look good, guys. Trying to maintain that hollow body, keeping that those hips tucked, lower back pressed into the ground. Ten more seconds. And rest. All right, going back to the top. We are now working for forty seconds. Resting for 20. Go ahead and grab a drink if you need it. We got about 15 seconds left to rest. All right, ready. Pick up that dumbbell. We got alternating curtsy lunge in three, two, one. Let's go. Working for a little bit longer. Try to work at that pace you were working at before. Keep it right there for 40 seconds. Halfway there, 20 more seconds to go. Good, Jess. Keep it up, Bob. Three, two, one, and rest. All right, shorter rest this time around. We go into that alternating dumbbell snatch. Remember, we're coming straight up with that dumbbell. Almost like you're zipping your jacket. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Let me see y'all be explosive. Keep that pace. Looking good. Looking good. Working hard, keep it up, Katie and Amy. Working hard, Laura, keep it up, girl. Way to go, Morgan. Katie and Joseph getting after it, and rest. Good job, guys. All right, on the floor. Ready, three, two, one, let's go. Looking good, guys, looking good. 20 more seconds. Keep working. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Three, two, one. Rest. All 
All right, starting round three in about 10 seconds. Going 40 on, 20 off once again. Alternating curtsy lunge. Ready and go. Good, guys. Looking good. You're halfway there. Keep that pace. Don't slow down. Looking solid. Everyone's looking good. Three, two, one, and rest. All right. Alternating dumbbell snatch. All right, get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Looking good, guys, looking good. Use those legs, explode on up. There you go, let your legs do most of the work. Got 15 seconds left. All right, and rest. Great job, guys. All right, on the floor. Three, two, one, let's go. Looking good, guys, looking good. Fifteen seconds left. Keep on working. Keep it up. Keep it up. Three, two, one. Done. All right. One more round at 40 and 20. And then we have our super long round. Rolling in 10 seconds. Round four. Back to those alternating curtsy lunges and three, two, one, let's go. You guys are looking great. Keep on moving, no one's resting. You guys are looking solid. 10 more seconds. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one, rest. All right, get ready for those alternating snatches. Three, two, one, let's go. There you go, let your legs do the work, explode up. Should almost be coming up off the floor every time. There you go, see you guys coming up on your toes. Looking good, being explosive. 20 more seconds.
almost there almost there don't slow down three two one rest all right on the floor If you can't, or if you're finding yourself getting tired or you feel it in your hip flexors more than your core, then you can always do a tuck instead of a full blown V up. All right, let's go. So basically just be a V up, but with your knees bent. Yep, just like next to you. If you're feeling fine, core is feeling solid, then keep those legs straight coming all the way up. Three, two, one, rest. All right, guys, one more round. This one you are working for longer, resting for shorter amount of time. Let's grab a drink. I'll give you guys a quick drink real quick. Then we're going in 10 seconds. Gonna be working for 50, resting for 10. Three, two, one, alternating curtsy lunge, let's go. Good, y'all. It's a longer time to work. Keep that pace. Keep it right there. Last time through. Last time curtsy lunging. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. All right, go ahead and get ready for those alternating snatches. You got a short rest. Ready, three, two, one, go. There you go, guys, looking good, looking good. Make it your best one. Good job, Bob, exploding up, looking good. Keep it up, Jess. Keep working, Jeannie and Joseph. You guys look great. 20 more seconds. Katie and Amy getting after it. Job y'all, 15 more seconds. Keep going, keep going. Keep it up, Morgan, don't slow down. Let's go, Laura. Five more seconds. Hard part's almost over. Three, two, one, rest. Great job, guys. All right, let's finish it up. On the floor, those hollow snaps or re ups or tucks, depending on where you're at. All right, let's go. Oh, looking good, looking good. 30 more seconds. Keep it up, Alex. Job girl. <laughs> 15 seconds, guys. Keep moving, keep moving. Keep that pace. Don't slow down. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, and done. Great job, guys. All right, grab a drink. We are done with that part of the workout. Next up, we have some back strength.
30. And 15. Okay. Sorry, I get my timer set. Hopefully I do it right. Because y'all know me. I always mess up the timer. Okay. Next up, we have four rounds, 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. All you're going to need is either a kettlebell or a dumbbell and a band. Uh, so for the first 30 seconds, you're going to be doing a single arm row, starting off with that right side. So get nice and low. Make sure your back is flat. Straddle that stance out. Keeping that elbow close to your body. So row it on the right for 30 seconds, and then you'll switch it over to the left for the next 30 seconds. Just like that. After that, you're going to pick up your band. We have W pulls. Remember W pulls, you're keeping your elbows close to your side. Your palms are up. Feeling a burn on the back of those shoulders. So that'll be for 30 seconds, just like that. If you don't have a band, you're doing scarecrows instead. So you'll have your arms out to the side right here. You're just going to be rotating up and down. All right. After that, we have rotational low plank. So you're going down into that low plank position. And you're just going to rotate your torso almost like you're go trying to go into a side plank, but both feet will stay on the ground. Like you're not going to be flipping all the way over to your side. Just trying to touch those shoulder blades together, pulling your elbows together. Right, yeah, so maybe show you one more time. Yep, just like that. All right. All righty. We're going to start with single arm row on the right side. 30 seconds of work. We're going to go through everything four times. So we we're rolling in 10 seconds. Go ahead and grab your dumbbell. Get ready to roll. Ready to rumble. Three, two, one. Let's go. Your best to just keep moving the whole time. It's just 30 seconds of work. Don't rest till time is up. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. All right, going to that left side. Get set. Three, two, one, let's go. up keep it up looking good guys try and keep that back nice and flat think good posture shoulders back keep that neck in line with the spine 10 more seconds three two one rest all right go ahead and pick up your band we've got some w pulls if you don't have a band you're doing scarecrows yeah just like that <laughs> the rumsey's got it <laughs> Three, two, one, let's go. If you guys have light dumbbells, you can add a little bit of light weight to the scarecrows. I don't know how light a weight you have, but adds a little bit of resistance. 10 more seconds. There you go. Keeping those elbows tight to your body and rest. And that last thing, a rotational low plank. Down in that low plank, rotating up. Ready, go. Yep, just rotating up so that you're facing the wall. There you go, just like that, Jess, looking good. When we start right now, mm -hmm. okay, <laughs> Good guys, looking good. Three, two, 
One. Rest. All right, we are back to the top. Single arm row on that right side. Get ready. Three, two, one. Let's go. Short rest, short rest. We're working halfway there. Looking good, guys. Looking good. Here we keep those shoulders back. And rest. All right, get set. Remember to think good posture on these. Roll those shoulders back. Ready, go. If you're still bent over, but we're sh keeping those shoulders nice and tall, neck nice and long. Halfway there, keep it up, keep it up. Oh, looking good, looking good. Five more seconds. And rest. All right, W pulls. Three, two, one. Good, looking good. Firing up those shoulders. And you keep those elbows close to your side. Ten more seconds. We're good posture on these two. Shoulders back, nice and tall. Rest. All right, back to that little plank rotation. Three, two, one, let's go. Looking good, Bob. Good job, Laura. Nice and solid, good control. Three. Two, one, rest. All right, back to the top. All right, single arm row. Three, two, one, let's go. Keep it up, y'all. Keep it up. We got 10 more seconds. Looking good, looking good. Don't stop. Don't stop. Almost there. And rest. All right, switching sides. Oh, Pookie. Oh, oh. Oh, Pookie. Oh, oh, All right, get set. Three, oh, two, one. Pookie. Let's go, let's go, keep it up. Halfway there, y'all, keep it up. The back should be burning almost there. Three, two, one, rest. All right, pick up that band. Get set in three, two, one. Let's go.
Evan's looking good, looking good. Keep that pace. Almost there. And rest. All right, low plank with a rotation. Ready to roll in three, two, one. Let's get it. Keep it up, y'all. Try and keep that butt down. Core stays tight. Nice and controlled. Three, two, one, rest. All right, we got one more round. Last time through. Let's make it your best one. Ready. Right arm, single row. Let's go. Oh. 10 more seconds keep it up it's a good job <laughs> and rest all right last time on that left side three two one, let's go. Looking good, guys. Don't slow down. It's our last time doing these. 15 more seconds. Rep it out, rep it out. Don't slow down. Three, two, one rest all right one last time with these w pools or scarecrows three two one let's go oh oh Keep it up, y'all. Halfway there. Looking solid. Keep that core engaged. Shoulders nice and tall. Good posture. Three, two, one, rest. Go, go, go. <laughs> All right. Low plank with rotation. Last one, guys. After this, we are done. Ready, go. Halfway there, halfway there. Keep it up. All right, and time. Great job, guys. That is it. All we have left is the stretch. Cool down. A little bit of flow. All right, grab a drink if you need real quick. And then we're on the floor for pigeon pose. I see a lot of y'all got started already. It's fine, it's fine.
All right. If you already started with your pigeon pose, you can go ahead and switch. In 30 seconds. Yep, yep. Sorry, Nick, some people started without you. <laughs> go breathe breathe deep as every exhale try and sink a little deeper into the stretch all right that was your first leg and go ahead and switch if you already switched legs you are in a deep squat hold so you're just gonna stand up Squat down nice and deep and push those knees out with your elbows. Yeah, just like that. Nice little hip opener. There you go. Good. Ten more seconds, deep breaths. All right. If you want to stretch out anything else, feel free to. I'm going to unmute you guys. If you want to stay in chat, hang out as long as you want. Oops, hold on. There we go. Now you're unmuted. 